And this is my last night at the Galloway Inn Luxury Hotel and Worldwide Resort. In just a minute, I'll tell you why. On this is dispatch. going on YouTube I am done I am done with my training we have finished glass class and I've got one night left in this hotel I've gone through orientation I've gone through load securement training and now I finished uh, glass securement training and man I gotta tell you I'm beat 4:15, 4 o'clock every morning Work until about six o'clock at night. Uh, I mean, you just don't get a break, not a day off one, but that's fine. Uh, I'm done with it now. And uh, man, I can't tell you, I'm thrilled to be, uh, to be going home. Uh, it's been a real long process and I've still got a little bit more to do. Um, of course, when you talk to the recruiter and the recruiters haven't lied to me, uh, but it didn't go exactly like they said it would. They said I would come here and go through all this and then get my truck and maybe do a load and go somewhere else and go to my dock work, which I still have to do, but that's not how it went. I lugged all my stuff all the way to Little Rock or North Little Rock. And uh, now I gotta lug all my stuff home. Uh, tomorrow morning, I uh, get on a conference call with my uh, fleet manager who's in uh, Laurenburg, uh, South Carolina, or North Carolina, Laurenburg, North Carolina. We, uh, there's like three of us, you know, that are regular drivers, not, they have student drivers and regular drivers, and I'm considered a regular driver. And uh, we'll meet with him tomorrow uh, via conference call, and he'll kind of tell us what's going on. But what it looks like right now is, uh, is I'm gonna go and meet with him, uh, they're going to rent me a car, and I'm going to go home, and then I assume, I'll find out tomorrow, um, that they're going to rent me a car again to go to Corsicana, Texas, instead of having to go clear to North Carolina, where, I'll, where I will do uh, three to five days of glass dock work training. Um, I, I think we're mainly going to be helping secure preloaded trailers for Maverick drivers to come and get and uh, and haul off. Just kind of some extra hands-on. Uh, pretty much everything we did uh, in class was, um, was I mean, it was hands-on, but we did it with uh, plywood and plywood boxes and uh, did all of our strapping and securing and tarping with that. Um, this time we're going to be working with real glass to see how it's really done in the real world. So I'm excited about that, but I'm more excited to get my own truck and hit the road. Man, it's been, man, I don't think I've driven in a month now, and, uh, and I'm ready to get back on the road. So anyway, I'll just give you an update. Again, I will give the details in the descriptions how if you're interested to come to Maverick, how you can do that, and, uh, and I'll leave it there. But right now, I'm going to leave you a little bit of video of us uh, uh, tarping up a uh, DGL trailer. Uh, how that's done and um, it's not the whole thing just kind of dragging the tarp across a few pictures of my classmates and um, and it's been a big time I've really uh, I've enjoyed my time here but I'm not putting on another set of steel toe boots for for at least a week at least a week it's tennis shoes and Crocs time for me so until next time I'm buck rub out okay why don't you come to the other side to do sound effects too <laughs> It's showtime. <laughs> it's showtime. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> hey, Ron. Make sure you turn around and show who's video. Yeah. Good job. Why does it keep cutting off? Walk over and open that app for me. back about two more feet, don't go off it. And bunch it up right here, right by that strap. Bunch as much of it as you can. Okay, Jackie, if you come down, come on down. Way you want to do it now. You're by yourself. You got that part done. What you're going to end up doing is taking this piece and holding it under where that nylon is on the other side. Don't worry about it right now. What you're going to do now, by yourself, you're going to get all four corners. Then you're going to do the zippers, and you're going to do the side, and then you're going to do the back. Okay. So let's go back to the corners that you were at before. Now this time. <laughs> 